License Card is a tool used by developers to protect and license Mac or Windows software. It can be applied to any kind of software developed with any programming language. During the purchase process, the company will send an image file called a license card to the user containing some information on the image and actually embedded within the image. To activate, the process is very simple for the customer. They'll simply launch the protected application. They'll see a welcome screen indicating they need to activate by dragging the card onto that screen, which we'll do now. It takes a second or so. The application is now activated and ready to use. Each launch thereafter, the license is validated and the application immediately begins to run. License card can be used independently or together with other tools from Excel software. For example, when using license card with the safe activation service during the shopping process, an email can be automatically generated and sent to the customer containing the license card image or presented on a web page. You can also use the license card tool with the app protect tool. App protect provides a way of protecting a desktop application with a simple wrapping process that requires no custom programming. DocProtect is a tool that allows you to protect documents rather than applications. Documents could be uh, like PDF files, a collection of HTML files generated into an executable, image files, videos, and other types of documents. AdLicense is a tool that allows you to use a wrapping process to apply the full range of license types supported by the quick license tool and you can use that in conjunction with license card so there's no custom programming required if your application does call the quick license runtime directly you can also use the capabilities of license card to learn more about these and other software protection and licensing tools go to www.excelsoftware.com scroll down and click on the protect and license button when using the license card system to protect your application you'll need to distribute the royalty free runtime file with your protected application a few lines of programming code need to be added to your application to send a command that activates the license during a drag and drop operation and also validates the license on each launch The license card application presents a simple window that allows you to define some information about a license card that's being applied to your application through the programming process. You can actually generate the license card through a manual process by clicking the right card button and filling in some information to create a customer specific license card that can be distributed. Alternatively, you can take some of the same information and have a shopping cart send a command to safe activation to auto generate a customer specific license card and send it to that customer by email or directly on a web page the license card system comes with sample code for a variety of languages including c c sharp c plus plus objective c visual basic delphi java and real basic let's take a look at the code behind this license card example project which uses a uh, real basic project that uh, can be compiled for either Mac or Windows computers. And we'll look at the uh, main window. Here we see our welcome screen. We'll look at the code behind the screen. And during the drag and drop process, when the application is initially activated, the license card image file is dropped onto the application. Here we see a reference to that image file is passed on to a routine called process license card drop. Let's take a look at the uh, source code behind that routine. And essentially we see that we're going to use some of the information for a license card and build it together into a command called card simple activate with some parameters. And we pass that command to the runtime file using either the send win function for a Windows computer or send Mac function for a Mac computer and based on the response we mark our application as ready to use or not. Let's take a look at the uh, send win function. Here we see how we interface our application to the runtime file on a Windows computer. We essentially declare an external function in the runtime file and we send the command string 
to that function and get back the response which the routine returns. So that's how the activation process occurs on each launch thereafter. In the open event of this window, it will call a validate routine, which sends a different command to the runtime. Here we'll look at the source code for the validate routine. Again, we take some of the parameters from a uh, license card and we send a different command called card validate. That command string is sent to the runtime and based on the response, it marks the application as ready to use or not.